hundreds and hundreds of limestone tanks. I mean, look how big this red tail is. He's huge. <laughs> Zach has been looking a little down lately, but I like to go ahead and cheer up my best friend by getting him some stuff. Wait, what? Follow me, baby maker. Smile, you're on camera. That's right, guys. We're back at it with another adventure yeah. with Lily with her new little rain boots because it's obviously going to be a little cloudy today. But we're at the neighborhood fish farm and we're going to be looking at some cool things out here. So let's go ahead and have some fun. Are you excited? I'm excited. All right, so we're out here and we're looking at all the stuff here at the neighborhood fish farm and it's looking absolutely beautiful with all of these little enclosures. There's so much stuff in between. Look at these cichlids. So the reason we're here is I did see on their Instagram, babe, that they have some crawfish. Yes, they have some crawfish. And Zach has been looking a little down lately. He just lost his white crawfish. Oh. And I also lost my blue crawfish as well. But I like to go ahead and cheer up my best friend by getting him some stuff. Sometimes things that he doesn't want, but I think he'll like this. So let's go ahead and see and look around if they have any uh, any crawfish, okay? Cool. Cool. Oh my god, guys, look at this. Look at the colors on this mudskipper. Look at the blue. Oh my god. The pearls on him are insane. What a cool little tank they got going on here. It just sucks up the water here, shoots him out. Oh, there's more. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Maybe we should get a mudskipper tank. This is, this is pretty lit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Aren't you fish? Look at them. They're so cute when they're little. They're so cute. They're amazing, look how cute, oh my god. They swim so fast. They swim so fast, it's amazing. <laughs> so they have goldfish here, they have everything you would possibly need in regards to community aquariums, as well as, it's, it's a pretty cool place, like look at it. Hundreds and hundreds of limestone tanks. Look at them, you know, you have these rhino plecos, rosaline sharks, electric blue Texas cichlids, it's like everything you would ever need. So what's really cool is that they don't only have small enclosures, but they have big ones. Oh, look at that little uh, iridescent shark. Well, it's not really little. They have a whole bunch of stuff here. This is usually full of a whole bunch of koi. And they have more little baby koi, a lot of iridescent sharks. And, uh, oh yeah, you're right, you're right. They have a giant, giant tank. Let's go ahead and check out the giant tank. It's over here, actually. They have the giants. Look at that. Oh, and the water levels are low, so you can see them. Oh, oh, oh boy. Big red tails, arowanas right there, big arowanas. Oh, they added some paku too to the mix. Look at that. The glare is really awful, but they added some paku to the mix. Oh, they gotten so big. Look at that guy, you wanna pet that guy? Go ahead and pet that guy. Yeah. Warning these. I'll pass. No, 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 he's just right there. Oh, these arowanas are ready to go ahead and take a bite. This guy's right here, look. Hey, buddy. What's up? Oh, man. They're just there. They're kind of cold. It's kind of cold because we've been getting a big old storm coming around our ways and stuff like that. That's why no one's eating. Look how big this red tail is. He's huge. <laughs> He's, He's massive. Absolutely oh no, massive. Whiskers. Look at that. We gotta get you some big fish soon. Actually, maybe you just gotta get a big pond so you can enjoy it. And we got a little jewel cichlids here, some more comments. But I have yet to see what we're looking for. Here's some koi. Hey, buddies. Look, they're gonna come our way. They're so cute. Um, we're looking for those crawfish. Let's go ahead and see if we can go to the tank areas and if there's any crawfish there. Whoa! Look at the size of that frontosa. These fish aren't for sale. That's a shame. Look at the size of this frontosa. That's that's gorgeous. There's a couple of frontosas here. There's a Jack Dempsey in the cut out there. Now, oh my God! On my channel, guys, you can see the actual growth of this arowana go from couple inches to a giant he's like so this. Big. He's so big now. He's That's crazy. Oh my god, he was that's probably the same size as drop eye. It's about 24 inches for sure. Look at that thing. That's oh a monster. God. Oh my it's god. Crazy. I want albino air one after seeing this. Hey buddy come back. Come over here. Love me. Love me. And for all those duckweed lovers, endless amounts of duckweed right here. Look at that handfuls. At a time. There's so look, it's on my finger. Go away. Guys, if you look behind this, it's a tank full of beautiful discus. Wow. Wait, what? Over here. Right? What's over here? What's over here? What'd you find? Oh my goodness gracious. This is everything we're looking for. Look at all that. There's a couple goldfish in the mix. Oh my god, oh my god, guys. These blue crawfish right here are mating. 
So that's a male and that's a female, 100%. They're mating wow. right now. Oh, they just got it on and it's all oh, done. No. Look at that. Them. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Now, you guys can't really see because you see a reflection of our feet, you know? Just those, you know? Da -na -da -da -na. You guys can't really see because it's like an algae boom because this takes outside, but there's red, white, and blue crawfish. So I'm gonna find a female blue crawfish for Zach, and we're gonna go ahead and surprise him with one of these real quick. Oh, he's gonna be so excited. I know. I know, he's gonna, be, he's gonna love it. So we're gonna go ahead and grab that crawfish and head right home. All right, Slayers, we made it back, and here is Zach's gift. Now, we're gonna go ahead and have this sucker live in there for the time being and acclimate. So when I go ahead and bring it to Zach, He's ready to go. What is with these people? I'm trying to make a video. Well, we're gonna go ahead and let this guy acclimate and everything. These guys suck. We're going back inside and I'll be back when we go ahead and let him acclimate, let him be free. All right guys, so the time has come to go ahead and release Zach's female lobster in here. So we're just gonna pop this thing with the strength of my hands. Pop goes the weasel. I don't like that water in here. So be free my friends, now we're all wet. Sorry about that. But uh, let's go ahead and check our crowd. Look at our crowd. Look at that vicious, vicious. Can she pinch me? I'll let her pinch me too. Pinch me? Nah, you're not gonna pinch me. We're friends now. Oh, 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 try to get me. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and keep her there. Look at her go, she's gone. All right, Slayer, so the time has come when we go ahead and take the new blue crawfish to Zach's place. So let's go ahead and find it. So I apologize for the shadow, but uh, I think there it is, there it is right there. There she blows. The new female crawl for Zach. I'm excited for that. So we're gonna grab some water. This should be enough. Put that puppy there. Grab one of these nets. Alrighty. Let's see if I can do this. We all know. Kind of silly when it comes to recording and picking up crawfish. Come on. Make it easy for me. Oh, here we go. Real easy for me there. Perfect. Let me go ahead and grab her right there. Relax. It's gonna be okay. So let's take a look at her in the light. Yep, 100% female. She's good to go. Look at that. Oh yeah. Nice and blue. Gorgeous. We're gonna put her right there. And we're heading right to Zach's. All right, Slayers. So we made it to Zach's apartment. And I've been thinking, how am I gonna go ahead and surprise him? He's really, really hard to surprise. He's not a fool. He always figures things out. Now. Um, we've been trying to breed these blue crawfish for a long, long time. Like, we have a personal obsession trying to get these blue babies or just colorful crawfish in general. So, I know he lost his, and he told me he was going to be making a video on his died. He told me he finally figured out exactly what happened, so he's actually possibly making this video now. So, I'm going to go ahead and knock on the door. I don't want to interrupt him, but I'm going to knock on the door. And we're going to try to sneak this crawfish in here without him seeing. So, here we go. There's a the crawfish right now, so let's go ahead and see if I can knock. Oh yeah, he's feels filming for sure. I hear him. I hear him. Wait, shh, 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 shh. I have a crawfish. I have a crawfish. Look, 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 look. It's a female crawfish. All right, gotta sneak it in. Right, we're gonna sneak it in. Look, let's move it. Let's put it in here. All right, we're gonna hide it in here, and then I'll be back when I'm gonna give it to him. Here you go, my friend. I got you a little gift, my dude. What? I got you a little something. Is it, a it is a crayfish, but not Listen. only a regular crayfish. It's a female blue crayfish. It's a female? It's a female. High five. Oh, you don't have. I don't have hands. Let me smack you. Hi, subs. <laughs> Here you go, bro. It's a big one, too. It is. You think it'll pinch me? Yeah, 100%. No. It yes. Won't. No, it won't. It's a nice one. He's my friend. I told you. He did not pinch. He's so nice. Beautiful. Oh, look at the light. Look at the light. Check him out. <gasps> it's a her? It's a her. No. No. Where are you going? She's so quick, right? She is a quick one. Super active. Oh, my goodness. I think it's ready for the breed as well. Oh, it's absolutely gorgeous. Ready for the breed? Yes. Let's really? make some babies. Let's make some babies. Come on. Follow me, baby maker. Oh, look. Oh, he's ready. Yeah, let's see the size comparison between the two of these guys. Oh, that's gonna look so cool in there. Oh, snap boy! All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put her in here. So you just bought this guy, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna make sure that she's like quarantined. So I'm gonna put her in here first. I wanted to just throw her in there, but I'm gonna make sure she's okay. Oh, yes, it is time. 
Time to be free. I wonder how blue she is in the light. I wonder too. It'll be the first time I've ever really seen her. Get in there. Whoop, whoop. Oh, yes. Look, she's like a grayish blue. I wonder if she's gonna get change colors like while I power feed her or if she's just gonna be like that. Because my mine is so blue. I guess because that one, that's pet store bought? Yeah. And this is wild caught because that's the one that we caught. Dude. It's interesting, right? I got this one at the Tropical Fish I wonder. Farm. I wonder how they'll do because what if the wild one just rips that one in half? Oh no. Yeah. That's <laughs> true though. If, yeah, they, I mean, if they breed wrong, that's exactly what happens. So what we're going to do, I'm going to have this guy. I'm just going to try to breed him later. But first, I'm just going to have this girl just relax. Get her new home, get established, and then I'm gonna rip her out and throw her in the tank with a big muscle man and get talk to have a nice date, you know. Yeah. Get him off. <laughs>